Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel and to answer a question about something that is part of our PCs most of the time, but people don't really know what it is and so some PCs have it disabled, but still have one on board. A lot of PCs, older PCs don't have one. It depends on the computer. Uh, it's something called TPM or Trusted Platform Module which is a technology for security at a hardware level. Now, if um, you go into your Windows security app and go on the left side to device security, you will probably see security processor. And here, by clicking processor details, you'll actually see um, what you have in a TPM or what type of uh, trusted platform module technology chip you've got in your computer and the manufacturer version number and its uh, specific hardware and version numbers. So this is a security chip that is implemented in a lot of computers. What does it do exactly? So you've got in a real world um, software security and hardware security. Um, software security is in general really good when it's well done, but it has the possibility because it's a software, because it's code that can be modified, it is possible that the information within that software um, key or encryption, for example, or password be modified in a way that will give access to somebody that shouldn't have to sensitive documents, for example, or access to a PC. When you do it in hardware, hardware is different. It's usually more secure because most of the time the basic cryptographic keys are impossible to modify. So that means that without that information, you will not be able to have access or find anything. So in what ways does the trusted platform module uh, work in a PC? Well, if you use Windows Hello, uh, face recognition, fingerprinting, stuff like that, if you use BitLocker to encrypt a drive, these are capable of using the TPM, the Trusted Platform Module, for the cryptographic keys. Which means, as an example, if you would use Windows Hello to log into your PC, you use BitLocker to actually encrypt the hard drive, if that trusted platform module be removed from your PC, you would never be able to actually access that information ever again. Neither log into your PC ever again in the accounts that you have. Because they uh, are required to have the cryptographic keys that are actually burned into that chip. That chip also is accessible, so there are things that can be actually stored in the chip to uh, have access to different software, security software, and, and encryption in any ways. So it's an added security, and um, it is there to make a PC safer and more difficult to access without having the uh, user actually input its password or uh, anything that is required to log into the system. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.